whatever. I'm, I'm, right, interested, right. I'm, I'm interested in, in, in um, whether or not you think entrepreneurs are born or bred. Yeah, that nature versus nurture question, right? I mean, I deep down think anybody can be an entrepreneur. Um, so you're bred, for sure. Um, it might be someone's born and maybe in their DNA, they have certain certain skills and capabilities, maybe a, maybe a greater willingness to take some risk possibly, maybe. But, um, but, but to me, that's marginal. I mean, at, at, at the end of the day, as we talked about a bit, being super committed, having a willingness to take risk, being strategic, all these I think are completely bred. And, um, and you know, it's, 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 it's something we're aware of and something we focus on. And, and, and think about this, you know, like we look at, um, you know, Stephen Jobs and some of these amazing entrepreneurs. And then, and then, then we look at what the, the myth of an entrepreneur is. I, I, I guess today it's kind of like uh, Tony Stark, I guess, is one. <laughs> you know, everyone says you have to be like Tony Stark, right? Or you have to be this loudmouth cowboy who's super gregarious and has to be at the center of attention. But what we really find is, <laughs> you know, except for maybe Jack Ma, who likes to be, you know, the center of attention and maybe Musk, you know, you know, most of these entrepreneurs, they're, they're, they're kind of, um, they're, they're kind of on the fringes on the side a little bit. <laughs> and they're just, and, and, and they're actually quite bored with <laughs> whatever situation they're in, except when they're focused on their business. And, you know, I, I think sometimes there's just stereotypes on what the behavior of, of entrepreneurs should be versus maybe what the reality is. And, 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 and I think we have to get over that. And some people mistakenly say, well, of course, you're, you're, you know, you're a born leader, you're a born entrepreneur, you know, like we hear that a lot, right? Um, and, 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 and to me, it's kind of comical because I, because I faced it a lot. Like I'm running on, you know, I'm, I'm trying to you know, get a business off the ground and someone says, well, you know, Fritz, the first thing everyone tells you, of course, is, you know, I think you're a nice guy. And anytime someone tells you that you're a nice guy, it means they think you're useless and that you don't have any capability. You know, that's what they're really saying because what they're doing is they're drawing certain conclusions on how you behave, right? Maybe being a bit introverted, a bit quiet, just sucking in all the information and, 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 and really not realizing that, you know, behind that exterior may be drive, ambition, willingness to take risk and some of these other factors that clearly are much more important, uh, um, um, indicator of success.